Hello everyone. I hope you all will be fine and and having fun. In my previous tutorial, I have discussed that how to categorize the six wires of the six wire stepper motor. Now I am going to tell you about the direction control of a stepper motor using Arduino UNO. First of all, I want to explain with the help of the block diagram, which will be more clearful. First of all, there is a power supply of 12 volt. which supplies the power to the Arduino UNO board and Arduino UNO sends the command to the motor controller L29A also known as the H bridge then L29A decides basically in what direction that motor has to rotate and we are using the stepper motor so there should be stepper motor after L298 and Arduino also prints the corresponding commands on the LCD we are using 20 cross 4 LCD having 4 rows having 4 rows and the 20 columns in it so now move to the source code Bye. because we are using an LCD so there is a liquid crystal dot H library and stepper dot H library basically is for using the stepper motor 255 is basically the maximum speed of the stepper motor and the stepper motor is connected to the Arduino with the pin number 4, 5, 6 and 7 and LCD is connected to the pin number of 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 and 13 basically the 8 number pin shows the RS enable D4, D5, 6 and 7 of the LCD and we have set the speed of the stepper motor around 60 that means the stepper motor will rotate 60 times in a single minute and 9600 is basically the border of the Arduino the rate at which the Arduino will communicate with the other devices 20 cross 4 is the order of the LCD that means 4 rows and the 20 columns now let us move inside the loop you can see there if we send the data C to the serial port the motor will start rotating in the clockwise direction and I have made a separate function for the clockwise rotation of the motor and this is basically the main function to rotate the stepper motor in clockwise direction and this command will print the executing command on the LCD and I am calling this clockwise function here now if we press the data A the motor will start no, the motor will start rotating anti-clockwise direction and here is a complete function for anti-clockwise the negative sign basically shows the counter-clockwise direction of the motor and this command will print the executed command on the LCD so that's all from the source code now upload the code now properly select the port of the Arduino sorry Arduino board is not attached from my laptop I'm going to attach it right now so now select the proper board I'm using Arduino UNO so I have selected the Arduino UNO and proper port which is COM5 in my case now just upload the code into your hardware and observe the results the code has been successfully uploaded to the Arduino board now open the serial monitor and start sending the command if I send the C the motor will start rotating in clockwise direction and if I send the character A to the serial port the motor will start rotating in anti-clockwise direction and if I send character S the motor will stop rotating and all the executed commands are also printed on the LCD and you can see there so this is the complete setup of the stepper motor direction control using Arduino I will explore Arduino by making further mini projects on it and I will share them with you. Till then, take care. Bye bye.